hello guys welcome to my channel ssk computers today i'm going to explain about the microsoft office 2013 version uh, ms of ms word uh, in that i'm going to explain about the insert tab insert tab tools uh, let's start firstly we will open the ms word with a blank document okay I'm just opening the MS Word with a blank document. So you can, this is my home page. So you can check for my previous videos for home features like tools like clipboard, font, paragraph, and the styles. I have explained in my older video. And now today I'm going to explain about the insert tab tools. So this is where, <laughs> this is what insert and it is having uh, so many of the tools I uh, will explain you now about this insert tools first of all is about the cover page cover page is what you know it's a document title you can give a you can give a title to your document now I will I'll giving a title for my document with the name SSK computers so you can decrease this size of this title and you can do whatever you want okay and wherever you want to move it you can move it easily and in the second page you can start your introduction blah 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 like this and uh, coming to the uh, second option the blank page blank page is where you can add a page under the under the existing page so this is a uh, existing page uh, this is the second page for my document now i'm adding one more document here you can see with the name three of three page three of three so it means the third page has been added see i will add one more for you here the page number will get changed when i click on the blank page see it has been changed page four of four it means the of uh, two blank pages has been added and this is my opening document title page and here you can do whatever the changes you want to and uh, coming to uh, the other one like you can add it you can add a table a table is a great way to organize information within your document it shows like however you want to add so like this by clicking on by just overlaying your mouse on the uh, table the table columns and the rows will be formed so now I will just select a four rows and the four columns and uh, you can enter whatever you want I will just s uh, enter with the serial number name address contact number and then like when once you finish with uh, so and so number when you press enter at the end of the page when you press enter the one more cell will be formed when you press at the end of the cell one more cell will be formed so if you want to insert a table draw a table manually so when you click on this so like this also you can draw and draw a table by selecting like this like this you can draw a table and uh, if you uh, and if you if you want to uh, insert a table inside inside this you can select the number of columns and the number of rows so I'll just select this as this one see inside ins uh, I've added a table inside a table so, and uh, yeah, you can add a picture as well so when you click on these pictures so I'll just go on to my desktop I'll just add a picture see like this you can insert a picture as well and you can increase and decrease the size of a picture wherever you want to move you can move it so by selecting this i'll just 
move it move it to another page and then this is online way you should have a internet for uh, adding a pictures from the online and this is where the shapes are available all this many kinds of shapes are available so i'll just select a circle and uh, and you if you want to link between both both two so you can add it with your arrow and uh, so many so many options are available like this like so many options are available and uh, going to another option uh, we have a smart art smart art is what we can easily uh, organize the things uh, for creating a hierarchy relationship matrix like a process you can show like a list also you can show now i'll just show you one example with the list formats i've just selected this one see it has been formed so like this easily we can uh, we can use this like we can use this for our uh, for the offices uh, uh, showing their uh, staff strength or you can use it for uh, you can use it for a cycle process recycling process like this so you can add a text like this you can add a text in this and uh, one more option coming to is uh, it's a chart so this is the most important chart this one will be used to recognize easily the values of it you can use as a pie or a bar so where you can show with we can you can easily understand uh, in the lines with the graph and the columns like as well each and everything like if i select this one so a uh, column will be formed and uh, uh, and uh, now i will show you uh, there is a one more option is there it's a screenshot option so by clicking on this screen clipping so you can just uh, take a screenshot of this blank page and that will be added over here so sorry uh, uh, that has been added somewhere else I'll just uh, take a screenshot of it again just select a screenshot of it and I'll just select a screenshot of it see now it has come why because uh, for the first time why it didn't come is because of the picture size is very bigger see now you can reduce and you can move wherever you want and uh, the other option is Wikipedia directly from here you can find out the meaning for that and with the full information you can uh, insert a comment as well so <laughs> I'll just mention with the desktop picture desktop sample picture it is and you can give a hyperlink as well hyperlink you can if you are saving if if not a saving if you have a already a saved file you can directly show by clicking on it uh, by giving a hyperlink I'll just go into my documents I can just give a hyperlink for it uh, directly and uh, uh, there is a one more option as well uh, let's take another blank page so that easily I can tell you like how to uh, how to use a header and the footer so I'll just, I'll just select the headers where you will have a uh, different kinds of header formats are available and here you can edit a header as well so I'm just selecting this uh, this header see here so whatever the message you have been entering here that will be available all over the pages as a header see SSK computers like when you go into an, uh, another page default your header will be added so 
here also it will be edited like this and uh, you can add a footer as well with the page numbers uh, and uh, the footer I'll just add uh, in the center of this one so I can show you with the default it has been added it's a third page see here you can see the first page second page third page and the fourth page and this is what fifth page and uh, what else uh, you can add a text box as well like with the default formats like for showing any content uh, and uh, you can add a quick parts with the document properties fields with the auto text it's like I'll I can show you it in the next chapter in my next video and you can add a font with the different types of uh, formats like you can change it by selecting a different type of word at like by this so you can edit whatever the content you want to edit and you can highlight it okay uh, that's it from the insert tab okay uh, thanks for watching the video if you like my video please support me to make more videos please do subscribe and please give me a valuable comments please don't forget to like and share thank you very much